Hey guys, welcome back. Ninja Llama here once again for another episode of Bee Siege. This is a special episode. This is covering a, a mini game that I've come up with and been playing here. Um, let's go ahead and check it out here while I explain it. As you can see, we have a vehicle here with some sort of scoop on it and and a what well, it's going to be a pin on the ground. Basically, the goal of this is to try and capture as many unharmed sheep as you can. Um, I've had a, a couple of... Oh, come on. We can do it. Get out of there. Oh, we've had a couple of pretty bad attempts. Um, before this, I had like a crane, and I could not for the life of me figure out how to pick up these guys without having them uh, explode. But I've had pretty good success with this design. As you can see, we got one in there. Um, it does get harder as you go. Because if you'll notice, they always... Oh, did we get one? No. Let's go ahead and uh, switch our design over here. Or switch our view over here. Um, let's go ahead and see if we can't get another one. And the difficulty will go up as you continue the game. Because you see the sheep run towards your uh, machines, right? Well, when you go to drop off more in your little pin... Oh, here we go. This is a good one. Oh, yeah. Double, two sheep. I had to turn the wheel speeds down because they were exploding while we were going. But here, here's something else. As you try to drop more sheep off, the sheep in the pen will actually try to get in, in your way. And you can end up, um, oh, you can end up crunching them. That was, oh gosh, I'm on top of a sheep. But um, you can end up crunching the sheep that you've already scored. Um, and uh, if, you know, Besiege ever gets a, a multiplayer, I think this could be a fun a fun co-op game to see who could get the most number of sheep in the time limit. Um, or, uh, you know, just if it's single player, just compete see who can get the most. I've personally gotten up to about uh, like five or six before I just started having them. Um, oh, oh, wow. This is terrible. Or having them uh, just start being crushed as I try to put them in there. Um, obviously... To make this fun, you can't include any sheep in your score that, um, you know, are just standing outside your pen. You have to actually physically handle the sheep in order to put them in there. This is uh, just the first design that has worked. Um, obviously, there's a lot better. And I'd like to see your guys' ideas and um, scores for, you know, how many sheep you can put in a pen um, without them exploding. Um, hopefully, we can uh, get this going. This will turn out to be pretty fun. You can see I had this, the back on here flat, and I was trying to get it to where I could catch a bunch of sheep and, like, somehow put them on the back of me, and then, like, back up and unload them into the pen after, you know, I had, like, five or six of them, and they kept exploding when I was driving around, but hopefully we can get that worked out. But um, this is uh, just a little preview here of this mini game. Hopefully uh, you guys will take interest and start posting some ideas for vehicles and um, hopefully I can come up with some more also and see if we can't have a uh, a fun time playing this. Let's see if we can't capture one more. Oh, here we go. I had to put um some armor in there so that way <laughs> they wouldn't uh, get stuck in there because they were not wanting to come back out after... Oh, well, that was a fail. But um, we got two in there. And I think that um, properly shows off what the goal of this is. So uh, please leave your feedback below. I would like to hear it. Hopefully once we get like custom maps and stuff, we can come up with an actual like a standard, you know, pin and um, set number of sheep. So that way everybody can play with their machines on a, you know, a standard ground. But for right now, I'm just on the Solomon's sheep level um, doing this. But again, let me know what you think. Hopefully I'll be back. Oh yeah, right over the fence. Hopefully I'll be back um, short with another update. Hopefully with another crazy machine to move sheep around. But uh, I'd like to thank you guys for watching. Um, please leave feedback below. I'd like to hear what you think. Please remember to like, favorite, subscribe. You know what to do. And I'll see you next time. 